Guys, thank you so much for watching this video. And in this video, we are going to see how to connect to our Hadoop training cluster for the Hadoop Starter Kit course. The Hadoop Starter Kit course is 100% free and it's hosted on Udemy. The objective of this course is to walk you through step by step of all the core components in Hadoop, but more importantly, make Hadoop learning experience easy and fun. You can enroll in this course right away at udemy.com slash Hadoop Starter Kit. I've listed all the URLs that I'm mentioning in this video in the video description, so you don't have to note it down. You can try all the examples from the course in a real three node Cloudera CDH5 Hadoop cluster hosted on Amazon Cloud. And getting access to the Hadoop cluster is 100% free. First thing you need is the host information and credentials for the Hadoop cluster. If you don't have the credentials yet, getting them is easy and most importantly free. Simply go to hadoopinrealworld.com slash Hadoop starter kit. Click on give me access to Hadoop cluster and give your name and email and we will send you an email with three important information. The first is the host name, which is the IP address to connect to the cluster. And second, we'll send you a username, which you can use to log into our cluster. And the third and the most important information is a zip file named clusterkey.zip. Download that zip file, put it in any place you like. I have placed my zip file on the desktop. Unzip it and you will see two files. One with .ppk extension and one with .pem extension. Let's see how to connect to the cluster if you're using a Mac or any Linux machine. Click on the terminal icon and switch to your home directory using cd till. Go to the .ssh directory and open the file id underscore rsa. If you don't see either .ssh folder or id underscore rsa file, you can create both and that is totally okay. Now, once you have the id underscore rsa file opened, copy the contents of the .pem file. Copy and then go to the insert mode in the id underscore rsa file and paste the content into this file. Make sure you don't have any extra lines and then save this file. Next what you want to do is you want to change the permission of this file to just read write just to the owner. You do that by saying chmod 600 id underscore rsa. Now you can simply connect to the cluster using the SSH command. Just simply say SSH, give the username that was provided to you in an email. Now I'm using here HIRW user 150430 as the username and an at symbol and the IP address that was provided to you in the email. So simply enter and there you go. Now you are connected to a three node Cloudera CDH5 Hadoop cluster which you can use to practice along with Hadoop Starter Kit course. If you have any issues accessing the cluster, make sure you're not behind a firewall that is blocking unlisted IPs. If you still have issues and you're not sure about firewall, a simple test could be trying from a public open network like Starbucks for instance. That is it guys. Thank you so much for watching this video and please share this video with your friends and encourage them to sign up for the course and get the cluster access so you have a buddy to learn Hadoop with. Thank you so much and bye for now.